Now, Way 31 Storm Tracker Meteorologist Amber Kulin with 31 Triple Doppler. Well, Amber, we've got all kinds of things going on weather-wise this weekend, mm -hmm. so people need to keep an eye on things. Oh, yeah, a lot of stuff happening. I had a lot of stuff to talk about yesterday, and same story today. So let's go ahead and get to what you can expect as we move through the weekend. Now, first things first, it's going to be hot again. We have a heat advisory that goes into effect this afternoon. So that's the first thing. The second thing, tracking that chance of some stronger thunderstorms as we move into your aspect afternoon hours on this Saturday and then the cold front will finally move through as we head into Sunday. So let's start off with the heat this afternoon. We have that heat advisory that will go into effect at 1 p.m. lasting until 7 p.m. this evening for most of North Alabama. Notice this doesn't include Jackson or DeKalb County and it does not include any of Southern Tennessee, but Everyone needs to make sure that they're drinking their water if they're going to be outside this afternoon. Temperatures right now, though, in the 70s across much of the Tennessee Valley. 80 in Decatur. It's 82 already in Muscle Shoals. 77 in Athens, Huntsville, and Gunnersville at this hour. Now, through the day today, we will start to see the humidity increase. So, heat index by 4 p.m. in those triple digits across most of the area. And our afternoon highs will be talking out in the low to middle 90s across much of the area. For pain, you'll be in those upper 80s this afternoon. Now, the second story for today will be the risk of some stronger thunderstorms. Everyone across the Tennessee Valley in that level one risk of seeing strong to severe thunderstorms this afternoon. Main threats, just like yesterday, will be some gusty winds, heavy rain, and of course, that lightning that comes along with the storms as well. If you do hear thunder, Go indoors until the storm passes over your area. So here's what we could be looking at. Now, this model not picking up on the rain that moved through Tennessee. And as we head into the afternoon hours, we do have that chance of some redevelopment across the Tennessee Valley. Now, this model not showing that, but I do think it is possible. So download that Storm Tracker weather app to get the updates as we head through the day today. Heading into your Sunday, we start off quiet, but we may see some showers move through. Through as that cold front pushes through the area right around noontime. After that, we return to sunshine. Now, 31 triple Doppler right now, like I said, that model not doing a really good job showing the rain across the Tennessee Valley because we are quiet for the time being. A wider view, though, showing a little complex of showers and thunderstorms moving through southern Tennessee at this hour. Now, the good news as that cold front moves through on your Sunday, we will see some cooler temperatures as we head into next week. Highs in the 80s and lower humidity as well. We're in that comfortable category starting off on Monday, and that's where we stay through the rest of next week. So after the weekend, things are looking a whole lot better. Now, not only with our Will our highs be in the 80s next week? Check out those overnight lows because as we move into the middle part of the week, we may even dip down into the upper 50s overnight. So a real taste of fall. Yeah, that's a welcome treat. Oh, yes, it is. Nice During change. August. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Amber. Mm -hmm.